Vlogmas day five. Look how cute this is. Yeah, I'm pale as a freaking ghost. Look how cute. Oh my god, this is so cute and cozy. Oh, hi kitty. He's going Arr, Arr, on his scratch pad. Well, I'm excited about this choice. If you didn't see my vlogmas yesterday, I got this from free people. And it's so cozy. Yeah. Are you jealous? The apartment has never been messier. Um, today's Thursday that I'm filming this. So, all I like need to do today is probably film a video with Aaron because we post tomorrow. I think I'm gonna clean out this storage unit little thingy that I have. Anyways, I need coffee. Oh, so loud. <laughs> So giving the cat the eye drops and the medicine in his mouth every day, we do it two times a day and I feel so bad every time. Because I feel like every time he's like, why are you doing this to me? He gets offended. He's like, I'm sorry. I don't want to do it either. Yeah, baby kitty. Look at this kitty. Oh, I'm so sorry for startling you. Oh, my baby. He's so perfect. Kind of sad because I was excited to get a Christmas tree and everything this year. And I feel like that would make Vlogmas Vlogmas if I went and got a Christmas tree and like decorated. But the fact that I'm now trying to get rid of things <laughs> and I would love to not have to pack a Christmas tree. Not that it would be that difficult. Probably, you know, it was just in a box. But I just don't think I'm going to do it. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really sorry. I feel like these Vlogmases are not going to be very Christmassy <laughs> at all. But this is what you signed up for. So... <laughs> Just kidding. So mean. But yeah, I'm in this just like weird space where I feel like I'm just trying to get rid of everything, but I also have still like a month. So I don't need to rush, but I feel like I have to, but I don't. I don't know. And I'm also just in this limbo of 30 days. So it's crazy because every month has gone by so fast. Like still feels like March pretty much. Um, but I feel like this month is going to go slow because I'm just really excited and I want to start the process of moving and everything. But I can't yet, obviously, which is fine, but I'm just like, what do I do? <laughs> so that's my story so far. It's like right after 12, I just posted Vlogmas Day 3 because right now it's December 3rd. So I feel like I should shower. I'll probably shower. And then I'll put this back on because it's so cute. I'm going to wear this every day. I just feel so like cozy chic. Why is my bedroom so dark? My fan is still on. Does anyone have to sleep with a box fan? It's so loud. Oh my god, I saw a TikTok in this girl's Spotify rap. I think her top song was a box fan noise and it was so funny the way the way it like presented the song and, and it's just like a picture of a box fan. <laughs> LA baby, it's always, always noisy. I also think I'm gonna sell this, um, makeup mirror thing. I didn't get it too long ago, but I just feel like I won't really use it or have somewhere to put it. I don't know. Maybe I will. I just don't know. I think I will sell it. Facebook market is like the place. This is the storage thing I was talking about that I'm just like dying to go through. It's just like full of absolute crap, but also not. Like it has so many different things. I don't know where to start. <coughs> <coughs> oh my gosh. Like this. Am I a 45 year old mother? No. Why do I have this? This one's very Christmassy though. I have um, a little bin right here and that's just stuff I'm donating. So I'm going to be like separating stuff and um, yeah, throwing stuff in there to donate. Like why do I have this empty box in there? Why would I do that to myself? <laughs> but you know what? Go off, I guess. Okay, I can use this box for trash for now. Just like throw stuff in there. We get so many Caseify cases and I usually just keep them because I feel like somebody I know is always getting a new phone. I like being able to like, oh, I have so many and these are amazing cases. So, oh my God, I have a funny story about this. Okay, so I made Zane go with me once to Home Goods. <laughs> he had never been in one before. And I was literally looking for stuff like this, like just like little nice, cute little things I can hang on the wall. I was like, I love this. I just hate that it says literally live simply. Like I just hate that there's like a quote on it, like a word. It's so cheesy. I hate it. And we were like, maybe we can go to Michael's and get a white marker and like go over it so it you can't see it. I don't know what we were thinking, but I was like, maybe. Also, these were so cheap. I tried to go over it. You can kind of tell at the end and it didn't work at all. So I think with this one, I was like, ugh, storage. I just hope I find something crazy. Oh, did you say a Cartier box? What do you know? Another case to find case. Oh, okay. Like they don't end. Oh my god, a little kitty camera. Definitely keeping these. I have two of these. And when we went to um, 
Palm Springs for Aaron's birthday. We were gone for like five days. And so I got these just to make sure. Cause that was like kind of early when we just got the cat. Well, it was a couple months after, but I was like, I just want to make sure he's like fine. I had Mike Sheffer come feed him and like play with him every couple days, but I just wanted to see what he was doing. But it was honestly kind of sad because a lot of times I would turn it on and he would just be meowing. <laughs> I'd just be like, I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. There's probably just so much. Look at that. Oh, I'm like, what is this? <laughs> it looks familiar. Was it a part of a TV or something? I have no idea what this is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I randomly just have so much paper. Interesting, but good to know. Okay, and then we have this bin just full of stuff. Oh my God, you guys are gonna die. I kept, I kept this like poster of Zayn's banner. Do you guys remember this? <laughs> like I can't get rid of it. Is that crazy to keep it? I just feel like it's funny memorabilia. Yeah, I'm keeping it. Another case to find case. A little hot topic. <laughs> well, good to know I have a ton of colored pencils, I suppose. Oh. Okay, what is this? Oh, a PS3, but there's no top? <laughs> I don't think it's called a top, but there's no this thing. I would love to donate this, but I don't think I can without the little... This guy, I don't know what this is for. All that's left are these little legs. <laughs> I definitely have the top to this table somewhere, I think. That's actually really crazy. I thought this would take so long, um, but I am currently surrounded by all of these things. I need to figure out where to put them for now. I'm mean, cool. Well, I feel like I just knocked something off my little task list. So that's- like, I have to brush my teeth after I drink coffee. I can just like feel it on my teeth until I brush. It's really strange. Like I have to. Also, I've always been this way, like before the pandemic. If I go to the grocery store or get off a plane or something like that, I always have to wash my hands before I touch anything that I'm about to eat. I can just like, it's like in my brain, I feel it on my hands. And as soon as I wash my hands, then I'm fine, but it's really weird. Here we go again. I remembered. Sorry, neighbors. Well, I'm gonna shower and I'll check back in in a little bit. I have been wearing these all day. These are genuinely my favorite slippers ever. Like, hello? I just felt like weird today. I guess, I don't know, nothing, like for no reason really. I think because everything was moving so fast the past week and today nothing has happened. So I'm just kind of like in this weird limbo of what I should be doing. I don't know. This is what I mean by I'm scatterbrained. I looked and I realized that I have this really old Keurig that's just been in the corner of the kitchen forever because I just like don't really use it. And I want to see if it works because it's truly been sitting there for the past two years. I'll end up donating it for sure, but I just want to see if it works. Like, I'm just curious. Oh my God, it's so heavy. Yes, it is very dusty. I will clean that, but I just turned it on and all of these things are beeping. I'm gonna fill this with water. This Keurig is probably like, where have you been? I know somebody that had a Keurig in an office. Like it was an office Keurig and no one had used it for a long time. And a client came in and the person there made them a coffee with the Keurig and an actual cockroach came out of it. So I'm a little worried right now, but you know, it's fine. What does descale mean? I don't think it works. <laughs> descale? Let me look up what that means for a Keurig. Are you okay? Probably not. Keurig descale. Oh, it's literally telling me I need to clean it. I think I need like a specific solution. I need descaling solution. <laughs> I'm just confused because it still says to add water though and it's completely full, but it's hot. And maybe that's because I was cleaning it, <laughs> in the hot water. I'm so stupid, I don't understand. Let's unplug it and plug it back in. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with this right now. Okay, I give up. Apparently I need some solution to clean this. Joke's on me, I guess. <laughs> now I'm gonna go film Carly and Aaron. That was almost exciting. Time of night, I have to give him his eye drops and I feel bad. Hi, kitty. Nothing's going on, I promise. He like knows now where he like won't open his eye. Like he'll keep it closed and I'll try to do this and I'll keep it closed. Oh! oh! We should have had the food I could just while he was yawning. Oh uh, yeah, oh, that'd, that'd be, be so, so bad. Mean. He'd like choke. Oh no. No, well you gotta hold him. Oh! <laughs> Hi, I think he'll lay back down. Let's see if he lays back down. Yep, there he goes. Hi. He's piss. <laughs> oh, no. oh. Kitty, I feel bad. Come here, baby. Sorry, but you know how this goes down. Okay. Did you get it? <laughs> I don't know, I think. Okay. Fair enough. I, know, I feel <laughs> like I, I don't know. It, he he's looks going like, like this. He's like, yeah, winking. I'm sorry. <laughs> <gasps> Now he's cleaning his eye, I feel bad. What time is it? I don't know why, I just think it's funny telling you guys the time because normally I'm such like, I'm such a night owl 
<laughs> it's 9 45. usually it's such a night owl like when things were normal i would literally come home at like 1 a.m and fall asleep by maybe 2 and then wake up at like between 10 and 11 usually i truly still prefer that i just feel like those are the best hours for me now that like nothing is going on i said this in a in our carly and Aaron video but i genuinely enjoy right now laying in bed by myself at like 9 30 to 10 30 and just looking at tiktok for like an hour i don't know it relaxes me it makes me laugh <laughs> i like waking up early when i have enough sleep otherwise don't even think about it early risers i don't understand you i don't get how you can function if i <laughs> if i wake up at like 8 a.m and i didn't go to bed at a decent time i feel horrid <laughs> like my stomach hurts i have acid in my like, I literally have acid reflux if I wake up too early. I don't know what the correlation is, but it's just true. It happened all through school, elementary, middle, high school. Like, I just felt like shit every morning. I'm also more headachey in the mornings. I don't know what it is. I just think my body is not meant for early mornings. <laughs> but if I get enough sleep, I'm fine. I just know people who go to bed at like 1 a.m. and wake up at 8 and that's just not me I can't do it even though right now I'm waking up so early anyways That's all I got today. I hope it's long enough. I'm really sorry if this is boring I don't know what I'm doing, but tomorrow is day six. I think Yeah Day six. I don't know day seven I can't remember it is difficult pre-filming these because I'm not sure what day is what, but I don't know. Anyways, thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!